Ever wondered how SpaceX's Raptor engine burns everything and still has power left to spare? It's not just another rocket engine. It's a monster that turns fire into flight. It drinks methane, breathes liquid oxygen, and somehow recycles its own exhaust to squeeze every last bit of energy out of the fuel. Today, we're diving inside Raptor's secret, the full-flow stage combustion cycle. Most rocket engines work simply. They mix fuel and oxygen, ignite, and that's it. Burn and go. Powerful, but wasteful. In those engines, part of the fuel is burned to drive pumps and then thrown away. Raptor is different. It burns everything, nothing wasted. It uses two small pre-burners, one methane-rich and one oxygen-rich. Each pre-burner drives a turbine that pumps methane and oxygen at incredible pressure, over 300 bar. Those super hot gases then meet in the main chamber where they ignite again, this time at full power. The result? Every molecule of methane and oxygen is used to create thrust. That's the magic of full flow. Both the fuel and oxidizer pass through the turbines, meaning lower stress, higher efficiency, and more reliability. The engine runs cleaner, cooler, and can be reused multiple times. It's like having two hearts pumping in perfect sync, each keeping the other alive. But here's the wild part. No rocket engine before Raptor has ever achieved this at scale. The Soviets tried it in the 1960s. Their engine melted. SpaceX pulled it off using 3D printing, new alloys, and years of brutal testing. Every Raptor now produces around 230 tons of thrust, and there are 33 of them on a single super heavy booster. That's over 7,500 tons of force, more than twice the Saturn V. What's more insane is how precise it all is. Each engine is cooled by methane flowing through thousands of microchannels in its walls. The same fuel that burns hotter than lava also prevents the chamber from melting. It's engineering on the edge of madness and perfection. When you see Starship lift off, you're not just watching a rocket, you're witnessing the world's most advanced combustion system in action, turning explosions into exploration. If you love rockets like I do, hit that follow, because next, we're going even deeper into what happens when all 33 Raptors ignite together. This is rocketry, where space gets personal.